Hey YouTube, it's Zero Shit RTs, one, two, three, sorry for the noise in the back, so it's probably bad, I'm recording with an iPhone 6, and um, yeah, let's get right into it, it's just an unboxing, let's get straight into it, let's waste no time, just uh, unbox it from Bloomingdale's, um, yeah, so, uh, I already um, opened it because I had to do it with one hand, like I recorded this before and I did it with one hand and it didn't turn out good, so I just decided not to waste you guys' time and just open it, so, yeah. Uh, I got this from Bloomingdale's. It's a book bag, and on the inside it says, "We hope you love it." And then it says, "Bloomingdale's, Bloomingdale's.com." Yeah, nice bag, if you will. I thought it was gonna come with a box, but whatever. So here's the bag itself. It's a spray ground. Uh, the Nightcrawler's book bag is really dope. Uh, let me take it out the packaging, and I'll be right back. All right, so I got the book bag out of the um the the little bag. It's a really nice bag. It says rip me open with the shark teeth. So I'm going to keep that. Uh, I don't know why. I'm just like a pack rat. But anyways, uh, let's get right to the bag. It's a really, really nice bag from the spray ground. Uh, yeah. And here's my old bag. I mean, I'm still going to use it, but um, this is a new bag that I just got, obviously. So let's go through it. So it's a primarily blue book bag with hits of white. And these glow in the dark, those eyes, they glow in the dark, and hits a red on, like, um, the zippers, and on the logo, and the white. So, yeah. It's a, um, I don't know the dimensions, I think it's 18 by, uh, 11 by 6, I'm not sure. 18 inches long, uh, 11 inches wide, and 6 inches deep. That's, I'm pretty sure that's what it is. But anyways, let's get right into it. So... Starting with the front, we have a pocket on the side, and um, open it. It's a really long pocket. Um, you can see that it goes from here to like here, so it's pretty big. Um, yeah, close that up. Then we have on um, side pockets. I'll probably put like some juice in here. Uh, yeah, and it's, it's really nice. It could fit like a bottle or two in there, or not two, but it has two, uh, one here and the other one there. So, and then getting to the main uh, thing, the main pocket, where all my books and stuff will go. Open that. It's a black insert, or it's black in the inside with velour on the back. And this is leather, I think. It says Spray Ground, NYC, Tokyo, LAX, MIA, LHR, HKG, and MXP. I don't know any of those except New York City, Tokyo, LAX. I don't know that one. I don't know that one. I think that's Hong Kong. And I don't know the last one. The Journey Begins, Spray Ground, and SprayGround.com. So we got... Um, here's your, where your laptop will go. This is the laptop sleeve down there. And then in here is your tablet sleeve. And then just extra space. It's really deep. Um, yeah. And then on this side, we got, uh, some more pockets. We got a mesh pocket, if you can see that. Um, and then we got another pocket that, um, I don't know what it does. Let me open it. Oh wow, that's that goes all the way down. If you can see that, it goes all the way down to the bottom of the bag. So yeah, and on the top of the book bag we have some. We have a uh, let's see. Oh these these handles. This handle is really nice. It feels like a seatbelt. I don't know if you can see that. It's like a seatbelt. But on the top we have a sunglass holder in velour. Let me show you guys. With the lure lining, I'll probably put my phone in there for when I'm in school and stuff, to for quick access. So, anyways, let's get right in there. Oh, we got some tags glow in the dark. Like I said, the eyes they glow in the dark. Spray ground. In the back it says quality plus function plus design. Night crawlers, velour, uh, velour sunglass pocket, velour laptop sleeve, inner compartments, durable polyester fabric. Outer zipper pockets, quick slip back compartment, um, and economic back support. Now these uh these straps, I think they're memory foam. Don't quote me on that, but 
it like the foam it like decreases or let me show you my old bag so the foam used to be really thick but now it's like thin because it like adjusted to how i usually wear the bag so i mean i've heard rumors that this is um memory foam but i'm not too sure and then we got more of the eyes that go in the dark um i'll do a glow in the dark test in a minute and on the back we have another pocket this book bag is just full of pockets as you can see it goes all the way to the bottom and um we also have a secret pocket um so right here there's like a zipper i know you guys can't see that well in the light i'll turn on flash all right so this is way better so we have a secret pocket in here and on the inside there's a card and it says congratulations you found the infamous stash pocket now don't tell anybody Shh. and on the other side it says spray ground uh the announcement has been brought to you by spray ground all right so dope that's nice i've never seen a, a backpack do that before like have a secret pocket so yeah um, and the receipt is right here if I didn't show you guys from Bloomingdale's uh, Right here. Let me see if that'll focus Bloomingdale's um, I got the I got this for $51 uh, Sorry guys, uh, the camera cut off for some reason. I keep pressing like the button to make it pause like I hope my camera like um, a weird angle so I pressed the button by accident so merchandise total fifty one dollars so yeah that's the receipt for you and i'm i'm moving it in a weird angle so that um because the address my address is showing so yeah and on the straps we got that nice seat belt material i was telling you guys about nice and nice and thick holes um yeah got some more red on the inside so i'm gonna be uh filling stuff uh, I'm going to be putting things in this book bag to show you guys, and then I'm going to do the glow test to see how bright these glow. So I'll be right back. Alright guys, so um, it is glowing, but it's not like bright like a Kobe 9 uh, glow in the dark, like the... Kobe knives I showed you guys, um, but they are glowing. Huh? You probably, you're not gonna see it because um, it's not that bright, but they are glowing. You just can't see them. I mean, you can see like faint green, but um, let me try. You can see a little better, but I took a picture instead. Uh, and I, I'll put that for you guys right now. So yeah, you guys can see it, but not as well as I see it in person. But this book bag doesn't glow really dark like how i was expecting it to but it does glow like um it glows moderately not too crazy but not um not at all you know if that makes any sense so yeah anyways guys <laughs> i'm gonna do this in the dark anyways guys this is the richard ortiz one two three stay tuned for more videos oh i'm gonna be making a video on um friday i'm gonna be posting one i already made it it's about comedy um it's me just ranting like always, but it's gonna be like on a bathroom rant, like how I did last time with the blizzard. So if you like that video, stay tuned because on Friday I'm gonna be dropping it. So yeah, guys, it's David Shortiz one two three signing off, guys. Peace. You can't see my hand, but I'm doing the peace sign. So peace. Since the West Coast fell off, the streets been watching. The West Coast never fell off. I was sleeping Compton after Mad been here.